idea. I think one of the good things about the proposed bills now is that all the people that are on Medicaid and were, were benefited by the Medicaid expansion are going to be grandfathered in. The perpetu in perpetuity, they will be protected. In fact, they're going to allow people into the expansion plan for another two years. At well, that point, the that's the debate right now. I mean, right. that's and that's kind of the core. I mean, this is a major, a major divide. If you gain this out, Congressman, leaders can't get more conservatives on board unless they cut that date shorter. If they do that, they lose you. So, what's yep. the solution? The, the leadership will have to figure that out, but I'm not alone. There's very um, many moderate Republicans sure. who are very concerned with the people who are helped by the Affordable Care Act. People working, and most of these people are hardworking people who, who just don't to earn enough to pay for their own insurance or don't get insurance from their employer. Uh, we have to make sure that we're not pulling the rug out from underneath those people. Right. We have, we have to make sure there, there's, the, uh, again, I'm not an economist, but there are people who believe that if we keep those people on Photo the expansion plan, area. Have, with the economy growing, they Photo will actually phase out because area. their income levels will raise when they won't be, uh, need to be on Medicaid at all. And that's so, not a bad thing. So get here's the thing coming right now. I've heard you say there are great things in this document, and also right now you have some great concerns. Are you a yes or no? on the bill that's out right now. I'm an undecided. I'm going to meet more with my constituents, listen to the hospital people. The hospitals are very concerned. Listen to the doctors who actually do this day to day and can tell us how this is affecting their ability to care for their patients. Healthcare should be between a patient and a doctor. Photo enforcement to make area. Sure that people have access to, to healthcare and everyone's entitled to access. And my goal is to, again, make sure that we help those people that were harmed by the Affordable Care Act and make sure we don't harm those who are helped by it. I have heard that from conservatives and Republican leaders alike. That exact same line you just gave me is the details, Congressman, and how you're going to get there. That's the tough spot. Congressman, it's great to have you. Please come back on. Thank you. Thank you, Kate. Thank you to the Congressman. The White House says it was unaware that.